so much lighter and a good kick to start had caught him in the cup. Uh, and we're back at it. The heavyweight's getting going. And another kick almost to the exact same spot for Mumperville. And a big uh, swing and a miss from Robin Hahn. Umperville landing some big shots. And the takedown. And Robin Hahn on top and now looking to work the jiu-jitsu that he's working on in the gym. You see in the corner, Anderson Goncalves. So obviously he's got some uh, jiu-jitsu that he wants to work with. Uh, Anderson, one of the better jiu-jitsu guys in the world. And uh, good to have that guy in your corner. And not many losers with Anderson in their corner when it comes to the ground game. Robin Hahn now working from the top position in a half guard of Umperville, trying to free up a hand, maybe land some strikes. And you see that Robin Hahn on top now and just kind of using the technique of being able to get so close to Umperville. Umperville not able to really use his hands to try and attack as you see a strike there from Robin Hahn landing to the head. Actually a, a professional bout, uh, just a little miscommunication on our sheets here, but this is a professional bout here for Robin Hahn and uh, Carmen Umperville. And here's a big shot by Hahn, body head, and that was a nice shot by Robin Hahn. Umperville trying to get that leg up to try and get it over the shoulder and defend, but Robin Hahn, like you mentioned, is landing pretty big strikes here from the top with three and a half minutes to go in his pro debut. Lots of downward pressure here from Robin Hahn. You see him starting to slide that knee up over top of the knee of Carmen Umberville, trying to get into a half guard and then eventually into a mount. But again, this has got to be really tiring for Umberville having Robin Hahn on top. Yes, he's a lot lighter than he was a year and a half ago, but he's still a very big man. And so landing big shots, and that was a vicious punch from Robin Hahn. Yeah, I could hear that one through my headset as Robin Hahn lands a big one, and he's been on top now for the better part of a minute, and he's been doing damage the entire time. Well, Robin Hahn's main job is he's a carpenter. He actually owns his own carpentry. Uh, place and he's got the, that carpenter strength. You can imagine the hammer fist is very similar to whack and hammer and if you've done it 100,000 times as I'm sure Robin Hahn has, that's probably a pretty dangerous weapon that you've got swinging there. So Hahn trying to set himself up, trying to isolate the one arm so that he can start to land strikes and you can hear his coaches calling for elbows, he responds. The mount position is excellent. He's got to make sure he stays low on the mount. He doesn't want to get put over. His positioning is good up against the cage, but as Umberville continues to spin, Robin Hahn then is in open area, and Umberville can use his hips to try and put Robin Hahn over top of him. But you look at Robin Hahn isolating the hands, and that's a mean elbow. And Umberville immediately turned away. Yeah, that was a vicious elbow. That landed with everything. This fight is over. Robin Hahn, your winner. What a massive elbow as he put everything into it. Robin Hahn with an excellent victory. The elbow was just vicious. Look at the blood coming from the eyes of Carmen Umberville.